Okay. Uh, so this is what I printed out. Basically, there's five globes and a globe, but check this out. Ah, uh, look how cool that is. So there's five internal rotating spheres or such inside a bigger sphere, inside a bigger one and a bigger one, but you can't get these out. Now, I did have a problem with this print and the points that you see here, what I did is I drilled them out and added a little bitty cotter pin that I flattened out. That's all I could find. And uh, the reason I did that is for some reason they don't quite fit in there. The regular points that were printed for this model, after I printed this, I found some better ones. And uh, this was the first one, obviously, that I tried, but pretty darn cool. Oops, I just knocked it out. But uh, anyway, if you do print this, um, this version didn't work out the best. These points, the very center, the very center one here is actually sitting on its original points. I didn't add any. The rest of them I added some just so it worked out better. But yeah, that's pretty cool. Oh, slippery. So, that's the gyroscopic spherical thingamabobber. Pretty darn cool. And you can't get these out. They're printed in there, and they're there to stay. So, Russ, RWG Research, once I get the filament extruder running, you better believe I'm going to be printing out a whole lot more very fun stuff and time-lapsing everything. So, Russ out. RWGResearch.com. Check it out. Peace and love. Laters.